Over the last few years, we've seen a massive change in the narrative of healthcare and how people receive information. You might say that there's somewhat of an oversaturation of information regarding healthcare. So as the chiropractic profession, how do we stand out? What is our unique selling potential and how can we express this effectively to the general public? We need to think about what the role of the ACA might be in a program and what the role of you might be as a practitioner. Obviously no, once we get a patient to the door of a chiropractor, the success rate for chiropractic is very good. High patient satisfaction is seen. High opinion of chiropractic care regarding its expertise and knowledge to that similar of a general practitioner. So the role really isn't for the ACA to do what you're already doing so well. The role of the ACA is to build the cultural authority of the profession, to build on our reputation and ultimately to get new patients to your door. So we know that 90% of people will experience significant back pain at some stage in their lives. And in fact, one in six people are living with chronic back pain every day. While we don't necessarily want to hang our hat purely on the back pain topic, clearly this is an area where chiropractors can make a difference. And as a practitioner, we can expand the value that chiropractic care may have across a broad range of issues. But to get the public's attention, to get that person to your door, we need them to understand how chiropractic care can help them with the problems that they have. And this is why the primary focus of our message has been on issues related problems, such as back pain, neck pain and headaches. The secondary message, however, is more about well-being and preventative care and how chiropractors can keep you fit for life. The message is very much delivered to the public, but also with a broader message for stakeholders. So the ACA have engaged OPR to develop our marketing campaign. OPR were very helpful in terms of dealing with the Safer Care Victoria issue that we had through 2019. But now it's time to get on the front foot and we're so delighted that OPR are assisting the Public Education Committee and the ACA Board in the Consider a Cairo campaign. We know that the general public want fast, accurate and reliable news. This is not something unique to healthcare communications. However, we also know that public trust is at an all-time low when it comes to ingesting information and marketing. With this environment in mind, it is vital for us as healthcare communicators to not only provide information, but to listen to the general public and directly respond to the issues that concern and affect them. When it came to developing a national campaign, we knew that the public's understanding of what the profession does was not clear. But what we did know is that once a patient walks through the door, their retention rate is impressive. So the challenge was firstly to explain what the profession does in a very simple way, leaving the door open to as many new patients as possible. This involves asking a question about a common health complaint, with the answer being considering a Cairo as part of the solution. It's simple, but effective. Now this is not just a one-off event. The Consider a Cairo program will run over the next three to five years to really consolidate the reputation and standing of the chiropractic profession in Australia. The ACA, we're very excited about this program and can't wait to launch it in March. You'll be getting more information about how you can actively get involved, so please jump on board and let's encourage all Australians to consider a Cairo.